Welcome to another DIY. So today's DIY is about these handmade paper roses. Don't they look real? Yes, they do. So I'm going to show you how to make these and you can use them for anything like room decor, projects, handmade gifts, handmade cards, anything and everything and anywhere and everywhere. So without any further ado, let's get started. Some crepe papers, fericol, scale and pencil, a bottle cap, a pair of scissors. Take crepe papers of any color. Cut 4 squares out of it. I have taken each of 12.5 cm. All squares need to be of same measure. Now, take one square and start folding from corner to corner 3 times as shown here. Fold all the squares likewise and you will have these 4 folded triangles. Now take the bottle's cap and a pencil. Take one of the triangles and mark a semicircle towards the folded vertex as shown. Repeat the step with all the 4 triangles. Now. Take the scissors and cut along the marked semicircle as shown. Cut all the four triangles. Now open up these folded drop like shapes and you will have flower cutouts with you. Now take one flower and cut out one petal out of it. Similarly, cut 2 petals out of the 2nd flower, 3 from the 3rd flower and 4 from the 4th flower. Keep all the parts, we need all of them. Now, take the 1st flower from which 1 petal is Apply Fericol on one of the adjacent petals of the cut out part and paste the other onto it as shown. Repeat this with all the parts as shown. The part which has only 2 petals Curl it with the help of pencil and stick the edges. Now for the single petal part, you will need a pen refill to curl it up. Now use the same refill and start curling the edges of the flower petals as shown. It is a bit time consuming but definitely is worth it. Once done with this, take the biggest flower, apply some fevicol in center and start pasting flowers in sequence of small, smaller, then smallest till you reach the single petal part as shown here. And here we are ready with our paper rose. First way to use this is to gift it to someone. All you need is a bigger square piece. I have it here of 30cm by 30cm. Place it diagonally. Arrange your rose sticks. I also use this artificial green grass to enhance the look. Now just wrap it as shown in here. Secure everything with cello tape and your handmade rose bouquet is ready. I use these paper ropes to pep it up a little. You can use it for room decor. All you need is this bamboo sticks. Make a cut beneath the rose. Insert the stick and you are good to go. You can wrap the stick with green tape if you want to. And now just go and prep your room up. Making them is quite easy, right? And using them, wow. I just love the ways. You can use them in any way you want, just not the ways I showed. And just take the paper and start making the roses and let the creative you come out and also do tell us in the comment section below how did you use these flowers also if you like this DIY turn the black thumb blue even if you did not like the DIY still turn the black thumb blue don't forget to subscribe to Flossom and Bees and also turn the bell notification on so that you get notified every time we are on YouTube. Also, please do mention if you would like to see more such DIYs, we would be pleased to do it for you. So here I am, the end of Flossom Bees, signing off. Bye-bye.